Hey guys, it's Natty Homemaker. Today I'm making a turkey pot pie in the crock pot. Welcome to Crock Pot Tuesdays. Okay, so let's get started with this crock pot soup today. It's a crisp, cold day today. It's November 2nd. So it's a great time to make something that's comfort food. So I had leftover turkey from Thanksgiving that I froze. Nice big chunks. So we're gonna put that in our soup today. But let's start with first adding a can of evaporated milk. Then we'll need about a cup of water. So I'm going to take some distilled water. One cup of distilled water. Just like that. Let's move the camera there. There we go. And then I have some broth, turkey broth. It's, I made a little packet there at Thanksgiving with the turkey. That's from the turkey itself. I'm going to put the fat in all because the fat is good. Fat is good. On this nice, cold, crisp day. My handy dandy spoon. Just mix that in a little bit. There we go. Let's get that a little closer. A little bit jelly. That's because it's a gel, right? That's what happens with the broth. Now let's get the whisk. There it is. We're going to need that. And I'm going to add, I don't know if you could see that, Knorr cream of potato soup, dry mix, right? I'm going to put a whole pack of that in there. Okay. I'm going to whisk it. Get all those chunks out of there a little bit. And I'm going to add to that, I peeled and washed eight potatoes. So I'm just going to cut them up and then add that to the broth. There you go. I got the potatoes in there. Kind of cubed them up a little bit. Just mix that in. Now you don't have to add any more liquid to that, but because, sorry, once it's in the crock pot and it's in there for a couple hour condensation from the lid, will make its own liquid and add to that. So, um, now we're going to add a can of vegetables, mixed vegetables. So this one has peas, carrots, and yellow wax beans. Let me show you. Let me drain the water out. There we go. So veggies. 
just going to add that to it. Mm -hmm. Mix that in. Starting to look like a turkey pot pie. Now for the best part, the turkey. Now I deboned it and everything so it's ready to go. Just going to cut them up a little bit. There's big chunks in here. <laughs> Yummy. Still a little frozen. I took it out last night, put it in the fridge, so it's partially frozen. Yeah, maybe I'll just leave the big chunks in there. So this is turkey. You could put chicken if you want, but I'm doing it with the turkey. So, like I said, I had leftovers. And I thought I'd use it up. Ugh. Big chunk right there. Ugh. Big frozen chunk. That's a lot. Oh, and that's a little bit of grizzle. I'm not going to use that. Blah. That's one bag down. And let me wash my hands. And another bag. Ooh, these ones have nice ones. Ooh. Mmm. 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 Mm. This is going to be delicious. Absolutely scrumptious tonight. So I'm not making a full pot because it's just me and Jay. And I'm just making enough for t tomorrow and today. Well, depends. I might eat it tonight. I might eat it tomorrow. Depends what I feel like. He'll eat it tomorrow. Because he's eating the pizza pie today. And so am I, actually. So, okay. We'll be eating this tomorrow. <laughs> That's okay. Oh, a piece of this. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Oh yeah, um, mm, mm. nice and tender. This was a very tender turkey. Like it was coming off the bone when I was done. When it was done, it was like yeah, nice and tender. So lots of compliments over that turkey this year. And I'll mix that in. No need for spices or anything because it's in the soup mix. If you wanted salt and pepper, you know, you just put it in your own bowl. There you go. That's it. So I'm going to put the lid on after I wipe it up there because there you go. Wipe that up. Make it nice and shiny. There's water in the lid. All right. So we're going to stick that uh, on low for four and a half hours. So I got that already and up. There we go. So low four and a half hours and bam. There's your lunch or dinner or whatever you want it to be. Turkey pot pie in the crock pot. Thanks for watching, guys. Like and subscribe. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I'll be back next Tuesday for another episode of Crock-Pot Tuesday. And there we go. Creamy turkey pot pie in the Crock-Pot. Now, I'm doing this without the shell. I'm just going to eat the filling. Delicious.
Oh, I almost forgot the piece de resistance again. The pizza pie from yesterday. I haven't warmed it up yet. There. Put it on my plate. Hamburger pizza pie. Time to eat. Dun, 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 dun. That's right. Ooh. Hot. Mmm. 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 It's oh. a mouthful. Mmm. That's for sure. That's good. Mmm. It's like a really meaty pizza. Mm-hmm. It's like eating a hamburger without... Oh, the hamburger and a pizza. <laughs> mm. Mm. And the man, which just makes it so much better. Oh, no kidding. Mm. So, hamburger pizza pie. Worked out quite well. With the shells from the Dollar Tree. Hamburg. Um, mushrooms, onions. onions that were fried up in the frying pan, olives, and manwich. That's it. Mozzarella cheese. Lots of mozzarella cheese and oregano. Mm-hmm. Delicious.